वेलकम टू अनदर वीडियो ऑफ ई जी बी आई टी एक्स वे टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ यू कैन गेट अराउंड ट्वेंटी वॉट्स फ्रॉम दिस ई जी बी आई टी एक्स विदाउट यूजिंग एनी पावर एम्पलीफायर और एनी मेजर मॉडिफिकेशन यू डू नॉट नीड टू डू एनी मेजर मॉडिफिकेशन सो हाउ इज दिस पॉसिबल सो इट इज डन इन अ वेरी सिंपल वे Uh, which I'll explain it to you. Uh, as you see uh, in our Easy PITX, what we have done is that uh, we have uh, three points, uh, three power, con three connectors. Uh, one is uh, negative, being the common. One is 12 volts, and one is uh, for the higher voltage. In this case, it, it, the higher voltage can be according to the transistor what you are using. so uh, previously uh, i was using irf 510 uh, and for that the maximum voltage that i could give was around 24 volts so now what uh, the uh, modification that i have done uh, is that i am using irf 150 irf 150 you can give around 50 plus volts so in this case what i have done i am giving irf 150 35 volts yes uh, you heard me correct i am giving it 35 volts and you can see uh, it is uh, like um, installed on the cover on the rear cover of uh, on the rear cover of easy vitx so here is it i'll show you a closer look so here is this transistor yeah it's getting the drive okay and here it's getting its voltage so this is a point uh this is the uh, separate point that we have provided so the uh, main uh, transmitter uh, final amplifier supply is separated from the exciter so in this case we are providing 35 volts uh, on the green terminal and uh, 12 volts on the red terminal uh, black one being the common one so now i'll give a demo uh, of uh, this set i'll first show you that uh, the voltage on a meter so here we have uh, uh, this is a module we are using so this is a crux of <laughs> the um, the whole story that we are using this chinese module which can give around 35 volts from 12 volts so uh, here we have uh, we are we have here uh, one minute 13.8 i increase the voltage from 12 volts to 13.8 to get a bit, uh, to get more drive out so that will increase my power and uh, and if you look at this module now we are getting 34 volts and 35 volts so this is coming out here if you see it is coming out here on the green terminal 34 volts 35 volts exactly so this is the situation and now i will modulate uh, the transceiver is on 40 meter band i have uh, in front of me uh the asu transceiver i have in front of me uh, the power reservoir meter with which i will show you how much power it is giving so now i am going to transmit constantly check uh, this icon this yasu the vfo is a bit of drift hello 
Transistor is not getting much hot. It's quite okay. Not much heat. Though I'm using a very small heat sink, but it is working okay. But I would suggest to use a, a thick, bit thicker heat sink. So that's it. The final modulation now again. Oh. That's it. Uh, this is the final of uh, test uh, video of PZB ITX uh, using uh, uh, this IRF150. So thank you for watching this video, and I hope the people who have uh, purchased uh, the PZB ITX uh, will have a good time uh, modifying their transceiver. And if you have another any transceiver, uh, with, if you want to use a a linear amplifier and want to get 20 watts so this method uh, if you apply uh, so you can get around uh, 20 watts easily uh, instead of using IRF uh, 510 use IRF 150 but this is in the case of uh, 40 meters or if you want to go for 80 meters on 20 meters uh, this transfer uh, I will give uh, I don't know how much it will give but I have to check out that uh, this transistor how much is it going to give on uh, 20 meters because this is not supposedly going to give much on 20 meters or higher bands so it is good for 40 80 uh, but i will try it on 20 also and see uh, what report i am getting so thank you and do subscribe to our channel thank you goodbye